hi family aslam alaikum it's me again welcome back to another video hope you all are doing well if you're new here my name is zainab and thank you so much for clicking in this video make sure you subscribe like and yeah so in today's video we're going to be making this delicious potato and chicken naan hope you guys like and yes let's just jump into it so in a mixing bowl we'll need half cup of warm milk half cup of of water also warm water um, one teaspoon of dry yeast we're going to give a quick mix half teaspoon of salt I'm going to mix it that again and then we're going to add two cups of plain flour So we just have to knead the dough until it's soft. So if you think the liquid which we add is less, just add a little bit more water. And if you think it's too soft, just add um, flour, just a little bit uh, dry flour as you're mixing until you get a nice and soft dough. So when everything is combined, I add about two Two tablespoons of olive oil and continue kneading until is everything combined to get this soft dough it took me about 15 minutes so this is how the dough must look like have to be smooth so now i'm going to just cover and let it rise for about one and a half hour to two hours we are waiting for the dough to rise we're going to be preparing the filling so we'll need one potato I'm going to cut in small cubes And we'll need two breast chicken. I'm going to cut in small pieces as well. We're going to mix everything in the pot, starting with my chicken. I'm going to add in uh, potatoes. I'm going to add in uh, carrots. The carrots I was having in the fridge already, so that's why you didn't see me cutting. Yeah, so I'm adding some salt as well, add some water, and leave it to boil. I'm going to boil it until it's uh, cooked everything. <music> Okay guys, so the pot is done, everything's cooked. I'm going to separate the chicken. I have to let it cool down as you have to shred to make sure everything, it comes uh, nice and smooth. So now I'm transferring the uh, potatoes in a mixing bowl. We're going to shred the chicken and mix together. <music> Okay, everything's ready. I'm going to mix together and add some uh, spices as well. I'm going to start by adding some red onions, chopped red onions. This is a chili flakes. This is mixed of cumin seed and coriander powder. And then I'm adding black pepper, some green chilies, fresh coriander. I'm going to add also some uh, chili powder and mix it. The only thing I didn't add here is salt because when I boiled the chicken and potato, I did add salt. You just have to mix it and test if there's salt. If you think it's less, you just add a little bit more. It's after one and a half hour. As you guys can see, the dough is ready. I'm going to just punch to remove excess A in the dough and knead for one minute to make sure all the A is out. After that, I'm going to divide in three equal parts. Mm -hmm. 
okay guys so now what is left is just to flatten the dough add the mixture i think i'll just keep quiet you guys can watch how i'm doing it Okay, we are done shaping our naan. We need a baking tray now. So I'm adding some oil and rub it just to prevent naan to stick in the tray. Okay, now we need egg wash. To make egg wash, you need one egg, some milk and mix it. Now what is left is just to bake our naan in 108 degree oven for about 15 to 20 minutes or until you see your naan is light golden in color. In 15 minutes our naan is ready as you guys can see I just love the color oh my goodness so while it's still hot I'm going to wrap uh, butter just to make sure it's nice and soft and also to get uh, to give the that brightness yeah so thank you guys for watching and if you did like don't forget to like this video share and comment down below what you guys think I'll see you guys in the next video. I love face.